Hi guys, this is Line6David and today we're going to go over using the preset locations on the Amplify hardware. So let's pair it up. Power it on. Hold down the Bluetooth button till it begins to blink. Now we're going to go to the settings of our iPad and wait for it to show up. We're going to select it and just wait for them to pair. And as always, as soon as they're paired, the Bluetooth button will quit flashing. We're going to start on the Amplify remote page, which is accessed through the three little hash marks at the top left hand corner of the page. We're going to go to My Tones, and we see the two tones that I've saved for this, Songwriter's Journey and the Lead Tone. I'm going to put these on the Amplify hardware. Let's go to the Amp. And you can see that I already have presets saved in these A, B, C, and D slots. But now what I'm going to start to do is I'm going to start to save this back to the My Tones page. And I do this by pressing the Save to My Tones selection up in the top right hand corner. So I'm saving these to back them up to the iPad. Uh, that way I don't lose anything that I already had on the amp. I'm just going to add my new tone to the amp so that I can access it with an FBV controller or I can use it in a live situation without an iOS device connected. Now if we go back to our remote and then go to the My Tones section, we'll see that everything's backed up in the My Tones window. Now if we use the Save to Hardware button, we can take Songwriter's Journey and just select where we want it to go. Give it one second and I'm going to save the lead tone on there as well. So again, save to hardware. And just put it right beside the original tone. The order is important if you're using a foot controller so you can switch to them easily. And one more thing. Let's go back to our Amplify remote and click on level. And this is the screen where if you do have a loop or a song that you're playing to, you can control the difference between the music and the guitar level. So this is how you balance everything out so that you can hear your guitar while you practice. And that's pretty much it for using presets with the Line 6 Amplify. This is Line 6 David, signing off.